back home and it could not be further away from London. This is so nice. It is absolutely lovely. Come on. Quick update on London though before we go into the house. I ended up being there for like two or three days, stayed with Alice. She cooked this incredible Christmas dinner. We had loads of people around. It was so good. It was such like a, um, a decadent, indulgent spectacle. And to match the decadent, indulgent spectacle, I've come up with some decadent, indulgent footage of said dinner. Let, you know, let, let me have this for sort of the next minute and, and 30 seconds. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you this dinner, and then to be extra Christmassy, we're gonna go inside and we're gonna do some Christmas presents. <laughs> you know, kitschy reindeers. This is brown paper that we're getting here. I don't want to be scroogey. This is, by the way, I've kind of, I'm thinking this is going to be very scroogey when I'm talking about all this Christmassy stuff, but I just don't like all the kitschy, you know, Christmassy, Christmassy stuff. When we were in the shop trying to buy some Christmas paper, my mum points them out to me and goes, oh, what about that? And I go, oh, it's far too Christmassy. <laughs> and then there's this lady standing next to us who looks as far too Christmassy, what's, she, she just couldn't fathom the idea that Christmas paper would be too, well, I've broken that. Present number one. There we go. Little known fun fact about me. I used to work at a perfume shop when I was studying at Edinburgh University. And during Christmas and well, just any time basically, you would be constantly wrapping stuff, gift wrapping stuff for people. So now I'm not too bad at it. These are not presents. This is posts from my old flat when I visited there in London. Right. <clears throat> I was wandering around London for so long on that weekend when I was back, just trying to find Christmas presents for people and just feeling more and more scroogey and upset with the whole concept of Christmas. Because I was just walking around just being really annoyed that I had to buy anything to start off with and then what's worse is that every single member of my family who I have to buy for is impossible to buy for. And then I found myself working backwards from the justification I would have to give on Christmas morning. So this is a nice thing of, of honey. And I was like, oh, I could kind of justify that for dad. He likes honey. <laughs> and I like had this whole script in my head about how I was going to tell dad, oh, but you always liked honey. This is already nice and brown papered. I think I just need to ribbon this. There you go, that worked. Do you like this, Mary? Yes. <laughs> this is a can of trade size, trade size mind, WD-40 for my uncle. My parents only told me that my uncle was coming to Christmas uh, like last week or something. So we've all had to be a bit last minute with my uncle. Sorry, Andrew. But in our house, we always give everybody at least two presents. You have one big present for under the Christmas tree and you have one slightly smaller present that goes on the table when we're all having Christmas dinner. WD-40, 3.99, absolute bargain. And very practical, very useful. My uncle cycles a lot, he will need this. He probably also does other things that would require this in his garage. I think this is good. 
Last thing is this, which is uh, my mum recently decided to be vegetarian um, and she is also very against me going to the Middle East to learn Arabic. So hopefully the Middle Eastern vegetarian cookbook. And this is hopefully going to try and convince her slowly via her stomach that me going to Lebanon is a good idea. All right, I'm going to wrap the rest of this stuff. Okay guys, I know I was feeling Christmassy before, but now it's like, it's like super hype Christmas. <laughs> so I think this will be my last video this year before Christmas and New Year's and everything. Thank you everybody who has subscribed this year, who has followed, who has commented. It's been so much fun. So I will see you guys again in 2018. <laughs> Remember to subscribe if you are not already and I will see you next time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, it's not gonna it's not gonna work. We need like multiple lighters going off at the same time because that's gonna burn off. Ah! <laughs> he, he smokes here.